Vladimir Lenin, a name we all remember, not just as the creator of the Soviet Union but as a man who changed how politics worked around the world. He was born in a small town called Simbursk, Russia in April of 1870. Lenin was the middle child in a family of six kids, his parents were both teachers, and they taught him to love learning and think for himself. When Lenin was young, he was inspired by the big changes happening in Russia. He wanted to learn everything he could and he cared a lot about making things fair for everyone. This led him to become a leader in one of the biggest changes in history. As the head of the Bolshevik party, Lenin started a new way of thinking about and doing politics. This changed how things went in the 20th century. Starting from a simple life, Lenin ended up changing a whole country, and in fact, the whole world. Lenin's journey to becoming a revolutionary started early in his life. Born in 1870 into an ordinary family, Vladimir Ilyich Ulyanov, who we know as Lenin, was greatly affected by the changes in society during his time. But two things especially made him a revolutionary. The first was when his older brother Alexander was killed because he was planning against the Tsar. This deeply upset the young Lenin and made him really angry the ruling power. Not long after he was thrown out of Kazan University because he took part a student protest. Being thrown out didn't just make him hate the ruling power more, it also led him to more extreme political beliefs. These experiences, along with his smart mind and strong will, turned Lenin from just a student into a leader of a revolution. These events can be seen as the start of Lenin as a revolutionary, which put him on a path that would change history forever. Lenin's political idea, Bolshevism, was more than just a political party. It was a powerful movement that had an impact on the world. Bolshevism, born from the fire of a revolution, was Lenin's answer to the unfairness and dictatorship in the Russian Empire. It was a call for action, urging the working class to fight against those who oppressed them. In the early days of the Russian Social Democratic Labor Party, there was a disagreement. One group, the Mensheviks, wanted a democratic party that included many different people. On the other side, Lenin's group, the Bolsheviks, wanted a tightly controlled party of experienced revolutionaries. This disagreement was not just about how the party should be run, but also about the best way to bring about a revolution. Under Lenin's guidance the Bolshevik party began to take shape. It was a group ready to take action, guided by Lenin's strong belief in the power of the working class to overthrow the rich and powerful and create a socialist state. They were not scared to make brave, firm decisions when others were unsure. Two important events stand out in the growth of Bolshevism under Lenin. The first was the April Theses, where Lenin shared his plan for a socialist Russia. He wanted to end the war, not support the temporary government and give land to the peasants. This was a big change that challenged the current situation and prepared the way for what was to come next. The second was the October Revolution. The February Revolution had removed the Tsar, but it was the October Revolution that really showed the power of Bolshevism. Under Lenin's guidance the Bolsheviks took control, ending hundreds of years of dictatorship and starting the creation of a socialist state. Lenin's leadership and the growth of Bolshevism caused one of the most important political changes of the 20th century. The world had never seen anything like it before, and its effect can still be felt today. Lenin built a new country, the Soviet Union, from the remains of the Russian Empire. After the October Revolution in 1917, Lenin and his group, the Bolsheviks, were in charge of a large, varied area. They had the big job of bringing these different places together under one flag. As the leader of this new country, Lenin started changing it to fit his Marxist beliefs. He made big changes with the goal of making a society where there were no classes and the workers were in control. Land was given out again, businesses were owned by the country, and everyone could get an education. But, Lenin's time as leader wasn't without problems. The first years of the Soviet Union saw a civil war, a lack of food, and the government controlling people's lives. Even with these problems, Lenin stayed in his beliefs. By the time he died in 1924, Lenin had changed Russia into the first socialist country in the world. Lenin's dream had come true, but his impact would last much longer than his life. Lenin's life was short but his ideas and his influence have lasted for many years. When Lenin died in 1924, his ideas had a big impact not only on Russia but also on the world. His death was the end of one era and the start of another. This new era was shaped by Lenin's ideas and beliefs. Lenin's thoughts about revolution and socialism became popular not only in Soviet Union, but also in other countries. Ideas spread all over the world and started revolutionary movements in many countries, from China to Cuba, 
and from Vietnam to Venezuela, Lenin's influence has played a big role in the growth of many socialist and communist movements. The Soviet Union, under Lenin's leadership, became a strong and powerful country. This challenged the dominance of countries with capitalist economies. During the Cold War, the Soviet Union was often the main focus world politics, showing how far Lenin's ideas could reach. But Lenin's ideas have also been criticized. His policies led to a government that controlled everything and often did not respect people's rights and freedoms. Some people argue that Lenin's idea of socialism was flawed, because it led to a government that had too much control. But even with these criticisms, it's clear that Lenin's ideas are still important in many parts of the world today. His ideas about class struggle and revolution have been used and changed by many political movements. In this way, Lenin's influence beyond his own life, showing the lasting power of his political ideas. But maybe the most important part of Lenin's legacy is the example he set. Lenin's life story, from an ordinary person to the leader of a powerful country, shows us how one person's ideas can change the world. From a simple background to the leader of a powerful country, Lenin's life shows us the power of ideas and how one man can have a big impact on the world.